Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing Vonger's After Frog. That's right. That's when I stopped being a frog, and I was a little sand guy. And I feel like I I, I feel like I have to change from being a little sand guy. Here's my math. So okay, so Paraphim opened up already a new world to explore and have fun and whatnot. And you know what? Good for him. Look at my spiral account, okay? So let's say I'm going to charge up on my spiral. Let's say I do that. I have three spiral. One spiral to go from here to Explo. One spiral to um, go from Explo to the new place. That's two used up. Now let's assume the worst possible case and that I have to manually return from there. So, one spiral to go back from the new place to Explo, and then I'm out. And, you know, there's no recharge centers in Explo. And, again, assuming the worst possible case, there's going to be no spiral recharge at the new place. So, three spiral, from what I can tell, is just not enough. Point is though, anyways, uh, so I'm gonna change my car back. I did ask my council of expert, and after the initial showing Paraphim my unique form, it's okay if I go back there using a normal body. So, you know what? That's cool. That's great. So, what I'm going to do, I, I wanna get my mechanical messiah. Um, Cause you know, if I'm going to be sent to a wild and crazy world. Uh, uh, I'm gonna bring all my weird artifacts. Like, that just makes sense to me as a thing to do. But yeah, let's see if I can do something about just not being in the dune buggy. I, want, I need more spiral energy. Uh, okay. It's, yeah, okay, yeah, you're... Why are you telling me that, of all things? What's Arcan? Is that good? No. You don't have my attractor anymore. I am so bummed. Uh, well, I have to go to the world of uh, Necros. Ooh, heavy lady, though. Spiral five. Okay. Heavy lady, huh? I kind of like the sound of that. I can put you here, actually. I can have three guns. Uh, let's put the special toys... Here, here, and I can put the messiah here. Oh yeah, I'm liking this. Heavy lady. I'm gonna be a truck now. Check it out, I'm truck! And I can get myself back another double gorb. It just makes me feel good about myself. Ah, there we go. Good feelings. Check it out, I'm a truck! Oh, I need to get Spiral on oh, its way at the bottom. I forgot. I complain about Necros recently. Like, what even is happening? Oh, man, I'm just 
having to do anything in Necros eats up just so much time. I'm starting to wonder, well, if I didn't have to go all the way south to get some spiral, it wouldn't have been that bad. Uh, put it somewhere, yeah, there we go. It's still there. So that works. That's good to know. Alright. Nearly 20 minutes later, I'm now ready to start what I wanted to do today. I want to try something insanely risky. You know, if it doesn't work, I'm gonna be very mad. It's gonna cost me a lot of time. I think it's worth it. What if I just dropped the thing here? Like, there's no one around, except for that idiot. But he's going away. He's not going away. Alright. Just gonna make sure that he does not feel welcome then. Because he just decided to randomly attack me. I don't know why. Like, I don't know what he was exactly expecting to happen. But, you know what? That's what happens when you attack someone with a hundred points of dominance, it turns out. Okay. You. Put you here. Go in, save, come back. No, close, okay. Uh-huh, yeah, I'm ignoring you. No time for blabbing. Um, I don't want this. Give me another gorb. I'm all gorb all the time. Good. Alright. I have to assume it's still going to be there. Yes, okay. So, if there doesn't look to be anything around, that is something I could do. Mind you, god damn it, stupid spaghetti! Uh, mind you, most things have several entrances, so this is kind of risky to do. But point is, literally after 25 minutes of recording, I can now do what I set out to do. Oh boy. One no, because going to the portal is going to be a nightmare in and of itself. Because of course it will. All right, you, 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 do you really have to stay here and do this? Like, do you? Do you? I don't want your stupid thing. Get rid of this. Okay. I got three artifacts. I'm in something that has spiral potential and cargo space. Let's go in that other portal. And then die immediately from something stupid, I'm sure. I should probably have it on my compass, honestly. Thrill. Okay, I guess I click like underneath or something instead. That's gonna happen. Does it look like anything on the map? Not really. Like it's just it's here. Where is it here? I don't know. It's on the map. Welcome to Thrill! For real. The load screen never has anything to do with the place. Alright, it's outer world music. Welcome to Lava Planet. I guess. Compass? That's all. This is all there is here. So my task is Paraframe was like, hey, go to this place. You know, whatever you see, I'm gonna see thanks to the... The thing. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, boy. Alright, so... What I'm going to be doing now is I'm going to do the same thing, except as soon as I arrive in hell, I'm going to use the barrier function on my protractor. Protractor, as soon as I can get... Barrier. 
All right, I have a shield now. I can see it. Cool. Yeah, and you can see the fireballs bounce everywhere. Careful about the lava, probably. I say, falling in the lava immediately. Oh, this is going to suck. And this is after a long, pointless preset, like, session I was forced into, too. Ugh, oh, no. Well, if I can at least pop up at this place, like, I'm, I'm basically just there and it's fine. My favorite part is how just slow everything is to set up. Okay, I'm shielded. I need to not fall the lava. I don't really have a path. At some point here, yeah, so just take your time. Like, easier said than done though, but yeah. There's kind of a road here. Okay, that did not take long to get to. Like, I'm not sure what I'm... Farting... Grass. I'm trying desperately not to fall. Like, I don't know, yeah, what I'm looking for. This is that super face seeing everything I'm seeing. And yeah, it's a pretty bad spot. No denying that. Um, I'm assuming there's something that I can do somewhere. What? Luck! Um... What did I just do? What? What just happened? Lucky fluke! Okay, that's pretty funny. It's pretty funny, but it doesn't help me out. <laughs> See, this is why I wanted to save before I use uh, the Messiah. I guess I could use resize to give myself a shape that makes sense. So I didn't go in this direction last time. Uh, it's kind of hard. I think I'm still just sort of vaguely going the same type of direction I was going last time. Maybe. Yeah, let's see, there's my portal. the thing that goes up and down. There's a nest cave of some kind. Detect a new reason. The mechanical messiah is in touch with... Listening to Carmain. We want to save you and your world from destruction. 
want to help you. We help all the reasonable. I'm pressing tab to make the text advance and it's making my menu pop out very awkwardly. It's pretty good. A terrible catastrophe has befallen your world. The reason is dying. We want to save your world. Says an obvious hell allegory area. We are kind, rational beings from another world. We cannot come in person as we are different. We know what must be done to preserve the reason of Univang. Three out of eight. You can save your world. We study dying worlds and cure them with the help of their own inhabitant. Each world is a treasure. We have studied your world too. The situation is critical. Those who live underground and don't move will die soon. It will be hard to save them, but you can do it. You have become dependent on unreasonable beasts that move underground. The reasonable lose as they're not eternal. They call their gods larvae. Yeah, that's right. That is accurate, actually, kinda. You can call it gods and dream of catching them. Their desires are correct, but hard to meet. The unmoving are unable to capture their own life. You want me to... you want me to larve. The longer they live with their disease, the worse their internal destruction becomes. The reasonable can get rid of the larvae's evil only by getting hold of them. You are their only chance. Your task is to rid your world of larvae, then the reasonable will be saved. You cannot kill larvae, only the subject can do that. So capture larvae, bring them to their enclave, and they will probably golden goose them by wanting to get all the larva drugs. That's probably what would happen. You can catch them and take them to the sufferers uh, by finding their larvae, the reasonable find themselves. Uh, after you have saved a reason of your world, you'll have to save yourself. It must be eliminated, but only but only the one who clears the world of our is able to do that. Be quick! Communication turn the mechanical messiah controls the reality. Communication turn. Wow. Well now uh Sir Con larvers have a reason of existing. Oh, well, I don't want to die though after after doing that. All right, just go, but don't fall. Oh, thank you, big lady, for being big and lady. Okay, I'm I'm pretty satisfied uh, with my communication. Now I need to refine the um, my portal out of here. I'm playing very cautiously. Yeah, I know. No, no, you see, like... I don't know if you know... Okay, so I think the fireballs, even if they're bouncing on my barrier, they still, like... push. And the ground, I don't know if you've noticed, it's very rocky and uh, uneven. These combine for fun times. Okay, but here I should be relatively safe. Boy, okay. Well, uh, I guess Paraffin probably wants to know about this. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get into Explos and go. Hello. That's my plan. Alright, so now, like, I knew that at some point I would be involved in removing larvae from their underground. And I just kind of took that for granted, uh, but now the game has made it explicit. Which kind of forces you to become a big truck, which is, seems unusual to me. Um, and also, while we're here, I'm surprised that doesn't open. That looks like the kind of structure that would open this little pyramid thing, but it does. Like, I'm just hammering the button. You can see it down there in the little icon thing. Alright, I'm stuck on something and it's fantastic. I love this game. Everything is terrible forever. There is nothing else you can do. Everything is terrible forever. You're stuck here with me and you. Just 
All right, then I have to open it, and then the music goes beep. Dominus minus one. All right, so you saw what I saw. Uh huh. Now listen. Okay, so yeah, you don't care if I'm a truck. You're not a special boy. All right, now listen to the story of the meaning of life. You might believe in the tales we've heard about the ancient Sompti and their clans with the Crispo. This is only half the truth. I, Paraphim, the last Spector, have been waiting for you to avenge our deceased predecessors. You've been to Threal and sense the presence on Ilian Fort. That is correct. These are the Infernals, the cancer of our world. But they sound so reasonable. It's true that there was a creature soup. No one could live through it and preserve the vile energy of the Sompti spirits apart from us, the Spectres. The Infernals came to Sompti spirits and formed the infinite mind... And conveyed them devastating knowledge. They were simply manipulating the naive softy. The most advanced of the softy spirits soon scented the treachery. But it was already too late to stop the wheel of history. So they hid themselves from the outer world and set about learning the universe in order to comprehend the essence of being. That's how the specters appeared. You. The infernals didn't miss the chance to take advantage of the softy's foolishness and blaze the trail that led to the unsparing Crispo. Yeah, yeah. Resettlement. So why do you want me to do? Only seven have survived throughout the... Yeah, there are seven towns in the game. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, two on two and one that has three. Arkanoi? I never went there. Oh, you don't want to go to Weeksow. So Weeksow, Cox, Boobs, and Arkanoi, which is another portal. I remember seeing the name of that portal, but I never went there. 
Although they're not really good for such weak creatures to inhabit, that is their only chance of breaking out from under the influence of the larva. So you want me to bring people to larva-less worlds? Huh. Okay. Yeah. You must populate all four worlds that I mentioned. To do that, take at least one passenger from each S cave, which is the minimum required to carry out Paraffin's plan. So, you take one dude from each S-cave and put him into one of the other worlds. No, yeah, so basically, this is just the regular passenger. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, no, I already did that part. After they've been set down on the surface, each passenger will start digging deep into the ground. Here, your task is over, as no one will ever help them beside themselves in the laws of nature. You will not win this devolution of life, as that is a very long process. So I will not, I will not see the fruits of this labor, is what you're saying. And this is it. He's out of text. Oh boy! Okay, so I was given two very different tasks. Um, although the game, I feel, presents the hellish occupants as perhaps, you know, like you, you get Carmaine's task, and then he's like, well, obviously, you know, he's infernal, he's a big bad, don't do what he does. But strictly speaking, I don't know that one is necessarily better than the other. Uh, I have not met a single rational individual in this entire Forsaken game. Is that the real one I want? So, this begs the question. Like, I, okay, yeah, I was not at a right portal. Because I'm never at, because they're both kind of identical. So what do I wish to do, you know? Because, yeah, like... Do... <laughs> removing the larvae from the world would absolutely destroy what social structure exists. And I believe Paraffin, when he says all that will really lead to, is essentially the self-destruction of both... Well, of all three nations, really. I really like the idea of populating the other worlds. I, I just like that idea conceptually. I, 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 I'm digging it. Um... Huh, alright, well, I'm gonna... Put this here. I'm gonna come back to it. Yeah, I know. I know it's gonna sit there. There's like no one around me immediately. Hopefully there's like no one around it to steal it next time. I'm taking a chance. Like I'm aware that that's a big gamble. Uh-huh. Keep your powder dry. A different game is on the way. No, yeah, I think I am in Act 3 now. Arkanoi, what is that? Uh, by the brew, we couldn't remember anything except sand and underground bees. Great! Sounds fantastic. Okay. Interesting. No, you, all you need is the power of magic. That's all. Alright, well, um... Coming up next... Something. I've got like a day to choose, but yeah, I really like the idea of swooshing the people around. That just sounds exciting to me, doesn't it? A lot more than stealing the larva. I don't know.